the ME-51N transaction is used to create the outbound reimbursable, military interdepartmental purchase request, MIPR. The outbound reimbursable MIPR, is a written agreement whereby the performer, agrees to provide goods or services to the requester in return for reimbursement of costs incurred. Now we will demonstrate how to create a miscellaneous pay purchase order in GFIBS. Enter transaction code ME51N, in the command bar. Press the enter button on your keyboard. Click on the purchase requisition drop down arrow and select the outbound MIPR PR document type. Expand the header information. Note, the information for the MIPR which will appear on page 1, block 9 of the DD-448, should appear in the white text box. Funding for Design and Engineering Services, August 1, 21, September 2018, RM, POC Lillian Black. Select the item overview icon, if it is not visible, to enter the line of accounting for a WBS element. This information is found in block 14 of the DD-448. Enter P in the account assignment field. Enter design and engineering services in the short description field. Enter 1 in the Quantity field. Enter Activity Unit, AU, in the Unit of Measure field. Enter 10,000 in the Total Value field. Enter August 1, 2018 in the Delivery field. Enter 2547 in the Material Group field. Enter JCK1 in the plan field. Enter 24C in the P group field. Enter L black in the requisitioner field. Enter W87, JNL in the destination vendor field and validate the information by pressing the enter button on your keyboard. Note, this is the DODAC of the activity who will be performing the work in Block 7 of the DD-448. Enter the LOA, S000, 22.1 in the WBS element field, on the Account Assignment tab. Select the Delivery Address tab. Select the Address Details tab. Note, update the address details such as name, address and telephone number to be populated on the DD448. Save the changes by clicking on the check icon. Select the Customer Data tab. Select the PR Gen tab. Enter Christina Wright in the Full Name field. Enter 803-751-7579 in the Telephone field. Scroll down and enter 1 in the SRN field as a temporary placeholder. Enter W37N02 in the Requester, Approval DODAC field on the Workflow tab. Validate the information by pressing the Enter button. Save your work by pressing the Save button. Note, 
copy the purchase requisition number that was generated in the bottom left corner. Now we can update the SRN number on the PR. Click on the Other Purchase Requisition tab. The Select Document box will appear. Insert the copied purchase requisition number if it doesn't auto-populate. Press Enter on keyboard to display the PR. Update the SRN with the PR number and line item number that is 102-074-240-001. Select the Save button to save the document. You have successfully updated the purchase requisition 001. 020-7424. This concludes the ME51N outbound reimbursable MIPR.